All right, everybody, busy day here at Pinky Tech HQ. Uh, so busy, in fact, I didn't even shave for this video. But it's a busy day because it is getting close to the live stream uh, for the $400 bill competition. And so today I have got the reveal of the actual PC, along with all the benchmarks and everything going on, and also the live stream with the big announcement at the end. So make sure you stay tuned for that. All right, so I want to take a minute and address the case because it was probably the worst component as terms and, and shape that I got. And the case actually ended up coming out okay. Uh, the stickers were able to get peeled off without too much of a mess. It did leave it behind a little bit of a shadow, but I was able to clean that up with some isopropyl alcohol. And then from there, it was just putting screws back in to get the hard drive caddy back in. And then also just scrubbing down the case a little bit. It wasn't a PC DC type thing, but it definitely needed some love and care and some attention. That way it would look good for, well, the rest of the modifications, which you'll see here. All right, but before we get into the benchmarks and the reveal, I did want to actually talk about the competition itself. So the competition is between myself, the lovable Pinky Tech, uh, along with uh, the king of the office PC flip, Dan from PC Tech Hustle, uh, the man that will review anything, John, the neck guy, and the most, uh, I guess, lovable nerd on the internet, nerd on a budget. And, and I really wish I had something negative to say about that guy or to make fun of him in some way, but man, he's just so lovable. Now, obviously, we had a $400 budget. We also had a small budget for aesthetics. Those things, though, were like stickers, paint, acrylic, stuff like that, if anyone wanted to do any case modifications. But it couldn't be anything that actually plugged in. So no extension cables, no RGB fans, any of that stuff. That all had to come out of your $400 budget. Now, the benchmarks that we're going to do for the competition will be Shadow of the Tomb Raider, Cyberpunk 2077, Passmark along with Cinebench R25, both a single and multi-tier score. And I've got all those in the benchmark section along with a few others that I normally benchmark as well. Now that's only a third of the points. There's also going to be another third for aesthetics, so how good do we make the actual machine look? And then another third will be gaming. That's right, on uh, Thursday, June 29th, we will actually be gaming during a live stream on these PCs that we created. So it's not only basically a, a a stream where we're going to get together and reveal the winner, which we'll be doing that as well. But it'll also be a stream where we're actually going to game against each other in a competition, and those will actually give us more points towards the overall winner. And what does the winner get? The winner will get this esteemed trophy that I made myself that spins. This didn't come out of the budget, by the way. Now, there's also going to be another surprise about these gaming PCs during the live stream, and I'll have a sneak peek of that for you at the end of this video, so make sure that you stick around, especially if you happen to be looking for a cheap gaming PC. Yeah. All right, but without further ado, let's get into these benchmarks, and then we'll roll into the final reveal.
And all it took was a few stickers, a little bit of paint from the hardware store, and some custom painted thumb screws, and maybe a Funko Pop, which not included by the way. And this Deadpool themed uh, $400 gaming PC really came to life. So I would like to thank uh, my contestants here, our competitors on the show, uh, Nerd on a Budget, The Net Guy, as well as PC Tech Hustle. And thanks for inviting me into this competition. I've really had a lot of fun. And oh, by the way, if you're looking to pick up one of these $400 gaming PCs, they're actually going to be listed on Jawa and during the stream we're going to set those live and they will have a hundred dollar coupon attached to them so make sure that you join us on the live stream on June 29th we look forward to seeing everyone there and if you're looking to pick up a cheap gaming PC we got you covered thanks everyone for watching hopefully I'll see you in the next one